Hey everybody, welcome back to the Joe Rockstar channel. Be sure to stick around to the end of this video to learn how to get your name in the Joe Rockstar videos and permanently handwritten on my 2016 KTM 500 EXC. Let's cover this bike in names. Well, the schedule for the 2018 Arizona Off-Road State Championship is out, and the new season will be off to a tough start on October 1st with one of the most difficult race venues, Camp Wood. As some of you know, last year was my first season racing. As a beginner, new to riding, racing was a completely alien experience to me. Each course had different challenges and I was not prepared for the physical and mental aspects of it, let alone my complete lack of experience with riding a motorcycle. Somehow, my KTM 500 EXC and I made it through to the end without major damage or injury. Just a bruised ego and a knee sprain for me, and a bent exhaust pipe and radiator for the bike. I documented the whole season on this YouTube channel. I filmed each race and put together a series of videos to share the experience with others. If you haven't seen them yet, please check them out here. But it's important to acknowledge that none of it would have been possible if not for the generous support of friends and Patreon supporters. Today, only four Patreon supporters, mostly strangers, provide generous financial support that help produce the videos that I create and I hope many of you enjoy. They deserve a big thank you from everybody. And I hope there's more of you out there who are just like them and willing to help the channel. Well, I see a dented pipe, smash radiator. Welcome to Camp Wood. <laughs> Last year, Camp Wood was an eye-opener for me. It was a tough course, but I was up to the challenge. Now, I'm not saying it was easy, and I beat my bike up placing a disappointing ninth out of nine riders, but I just was not at the same level skill-wise as my competition. Where others seem to dislike the climbing, loose, rocky trails in the mountains 70 miles northwest of Prescott, Arizona, I actually enjoyed it. And I'm looking forward to getting back up there and doing better this year. Yeah! Alright, thanks everybody, that was fun. You guys did a great job. We're at the finish. Pretty exhausted. My arms are, are like spaghetti, uh, which reminds me of the spaghetti that I made last night. I have some leftovers. I'm gonna eat it, and I'm gonna drive home. What do you think of the race? Oh, what I think of the race? It wasn't as difficult as I thought it was gonna be, and it was a little more difficult than I thought it was gonna be at the same time. The endurance part of it didn't get me as bad as the last race it did. Uh, the riding level was pretty difficult. The rocks beat you up. They really, really wear you, wear you down.
Next on the schedule is a Santa Rita shootout on October 22nd. Last year, this Halloween race was truly scary with its lack of visibility through the billowing dust and the hellish variations of terrain. From deep powdered sand, dense vegetation, treacherous rocky ravines, a motocross track, to a rocky trials-esque section, this race was both a nightmare and a fun experience. November 12th will mark the return to Wikiup, Arizona, the site of the Big Sandy. A venue that is literally a machine gun range turned race course. It is littered with deep whoops that never seem to end on what seems to be miles of quicksand. Last year it beat me, but I've come a long way since then, and it's not gonna happen again. After the holidays break, we'll return to Arizona Cycle Park in Buckeye, Arizona, January 6th combination of motocross, single track, and sand washes, this course is a blast. Let's hope I don't lose the camera on this course this year. And even though it provided me some great shots last year, I'd rather not go through the stress of thinking I'll never see my camera again. Two weeks later, it's off to mile markers in Wickenburg and one of my favorite races of the season. Although I crashed in every section, even the transfer sections where we weren't racing, this race was exhilarating. It was the first time that I felt like I was riding well and that I was crashing only because I was going too fast and not because I was still barely learning how to ride. February 18th is the unknown, the X Factor. Last year, Prescott Trail Riders hosted this race in Kirkland, Arizona, and it was a mud fest. But this year, it's going to be a new venue. I have no idea what to expect. My prediction for this race? Well, in the words of the great Clubber Lang. Prediction? Yes, prediction. Pain. As a member of the Trail Riders of Southern Arizona, I'll be working the March 3rd race that goes on in Tucson, Arizona. Last year's race in San Manuel was a big hit and I was proud to be a part of it. And then the season finale will wind up in Globe, Arizona on April 7th. And this had to be my favorite race of the year last year. An amazing event put on by Rockstars MC. It was definitely a test of everything I had learned through the season. It had a little bit of everything from flat track, sandy washes, tight single track, hill climbs, and bone breaking enduro cross sections. I can't wait to get a second chance at this one. 
Unfortunately, I doubt I will be able to make it to all of these races without your help. If you're interested in being a part of this adventure, please go to my Patreon page and pledge your support for the upcoming season. Pledge as little as $1 a month. Every little bit helps, and every bit of it goes into keeping this channel alive. This season, you can expect a much more competitive Joe Rockstar. I'm not a rookie anymore, and I'm excited to see how I stack up against the competition only a year later. I also hope to improve the quality of production for each race video. Just like last season, I will try to balance placing you, the viewer, in the action as you ride along with me, while providing the story behind the race. Patreon supporters will have early and behind-the-scenes access available only to them. In addition, anyone who pledges at least $5 of support per month for three months will get their name on my bike. Help me cover this bike in names. Patreon supporters will automatically be entered in an end-of-season giveaway, and they can opt to have their name or business appear in my videos. If you live in Arizona and you would like to start racing, contact me and I will help you get signed up. Thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you at the races.